it is eight o'clock and your girl is up. I need to fix my squeaky chair. I need to fix my squeaky chair. I don't know what's up with that one. Actually, I do. It's squeaky. <laughs> but good morning, guys. Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new and here, hey, what's up? Welcome. Please don't forget to click the subscribe button um, and like the video. I am trying to get to 100, 100? I'm trying to get to 150k followers on Instagram. So please do go and support. I have been creating new reels. If you haven't seen them, go and follow me at Lydia Dinga and follow me and subscribe <laughs> follow me subscribe guys it's too early i meant to say it really helps me out if you guys like the video um so please don't forget to thumbs it up we're trying to get to 225k subscribers by the end of january so help your girl out on her goal that was a lot of words that's a lot of words really i'm hungry <laughs> i'm hungry i'm sat here in my makeup room but i'm not doing any makeup today i just i'm gonna pop my wig on and just moisturize my skin I have just added this, this is the Biosense, I think that's how you say it, vitamin C rose oil. This is my second bottle. This is so, so good for just like adding hydration, a little bit of a glow to your skin. Um, this is a facial oil to visibly brighten and firm. And I highly agree. This is my second purchase of this. Yeah, so this morning we're going to my dentist. I have a new dentist. I'm seeing a new dentist, but I feel like I'll just catch you guys all up on that when I'm in the car. I'm just here to pop my wig on and then I want to go and make some breakfast because I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Like, how do I wake up hungry? In fact, I know how I wake up hungry because I ate lot. I ate late last night and every single time I eat late, the first thing I, when I wake up is just hunger. Like, it's ridiculous. It's actually ridiculous. I don't know if anybody else feels that way. But anyway, today we're going to spend the whole day together. So get ready to buckle up and run some errands with me and I will fill you in on what else is going on with me but first let me just get my hairbrush comb this wig pop it on go and make a quick egg breakfast and then jump out and then let's go because I want to get to my dentist on time today keeping the fit super simple I've just got this plain black top from misguided and some like gym yoga pants They're very comfortable this is going to be a comfortable morning. I also went downstairs and put my eggs to boil. You guys know I love eggs so freaking much. What is Lydia without eggs? Nothing. Nothing. So let's go and get my eggs. I really debated putting on makeup this morning, but I don't know. I just don't have that effort right now. I really don't. I've got effort for it. I've got a lip balm. That's about it. Maybe later I might change my mind, but right now, moving it's a good thing that was empty look at that it's a good thing i finished that this morning jesus christ my laundry it's another thing that i need to do i tweeted last night between taxes laundry and dusting adulting is ghetto it's really the ghetto just got my eggs here and a little egg maker should be done soon. Oh, literally, just as I said that, it's just popped, which means that my eggs are ready. I love boiled eggs. I love them. <laughs> I love all types of eggs. In fact, I think the last thing I had last night, I made myself a little snack after dinner, which was eggs, fried eggs. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Um, I need to put my washing on before I go as well. It's honestly endless. How do you guys keep up with your washing loads? Because I'm finding it tough, man. Every single day, I swear I put a what, like a load on. Okay, I really don't, but it feels like I put on a load on a washing every single day. I have no idea how ladies with kids manage. Like you have to wash everybody's clothes. That's even worse. Oh God. <laughs> I mean, honestly, guys, I am barely managing. Barely managing. Now. I'm gonna do the coloured stuff. I'm even separating my laundry into coloureds, into whites, into blacks. Sounds basic, but listen, I didn't do that before. I hate doing laundry. I really, really hate it. What is the dust on and brush doing in here? I must have been sweeping. That's another thing that I spent a lot of my time doing. Sweeping. Oh my god. Owning your own home, honestly, I can't lie. It is top tier in regards to being able to like it's, the, it's an achievement to start with but 
all of the maintenance that comes with it. That wasn't told, like I wasn't told about that. I was only told about the mortgage. I was only told about the bills that I had to pay. Like all of the maintenance that comes with having a house, dusting, brushing, keeping the house clean all the time. Trying to keep like, and it's, it's only a two bedroom house. How do people who have bigger houses do it? Like how do they honestly do it? It's, is there like a schedule that you need to have for cleaning? People with big houses, teach me, teach me please. How do you keep the house clean 24 seven? Because if it's not dusting the skirting boards, you gotta dust the lights. Dust, I need to dust my light bulbs. Do you think that's something I'd envision for myself like in 2022? No, but I actually have to go around dusting my light bulbs in my bedroom and this one here. Dusting the shelves, dusting the skirting boards. Did you know that you have to dust skirting boards? Sweeping every other day, every other day. In fact, look, I slept last night. And why am I seeing dust here already? I feel like the new houses, is it a new house thing? Is it settling down? Because there's a lot of dust. There is dust every single day and it drives me insane. Like literally it's to the point where I put my dustpan in my laundry bag, <laughs> it drives me nuts. Let me wash this stuff. This is all dark colors wash this including my pillowcase because this is super oily and then let's have my eggs and let's think about going some capsules you really just need one but i like the smell of the other one oh no <laughs> guys unbelievable scenes unbelievable scenes I forgot to put one of the pillowcases in. This is even the one that's really that took off my bed and the washing machine is already on. This is what I mean, like, this is just, it's too early. What, I need, let me put my watch on and just get on with my day because, how, how am I gonna do myself like that, how? How, now to hand wash this. One of my least favorite things about winter when your car windscreen gets all icy and you have to wait for it to re defrost zero out of ten winter is just not my season like what who wants to be dealing with this who really wants to be dealing with this let's crank up the heat guys if i really thought this through last night i would have just stayed at my boo's house tell me why it's an 11 minute drive from his place 11 minutes i just didn't think I didn't think. Ooh, skin game popping too. I'm really trying to step up my real game. Um, so I was literally working probably until about 10 p.m. last night. If I just thought, I would've just stayed at my boo's house, got cuddles and got here super quick. Like, Lydia, so silly. But either way, I should be on time still. I'm running on time, which is a statement I didn't even know I could say. But really, I really mean it. This year, I'm gonna try it. I'm really trying with my time, for sure. For shizzle! Tag names, right? <laughs> and if you don't know what a tag name is, it was kind of like your name from ends, what people yeah. know you as, a nickname. These guys are about to test the fire alarm. They've just made an announcement, so it's gonna go off. But I've just got here. Um, now let's go and see this dentist, guys. I really, I'm so excited to find another dentist. Also, I made my eggs and I took them with me because what an L. Can you imagine if I had eggs before my dentist appointment? Wow, Lydia, that would have been no respect for the doctor. None. Wallet, got keys. I'm so scared of this alarm going off. Oh. Dr. Christine is um, here in Battersea getting my teeth looked at again. You guys know the first journey and you know I had to ditch that real quick. <laughs> so we're gonna get and um, basically get another assessment. Dr. Christine, what are we doing? What are you doing today? So what we're gonna do, do you is... mind being on cam? No, go for it. Okay. So what we're gonna do today is a full consultation because we're trying to get her teeth wedding ready. We're gonna start by doing a digital scan of the teeth which will give us a rough simulated before and after of what we can achieve with Invisalign because I want to put the teeth into a slightly better position yeah. um, for then us to bond on top of that. 
Um, in my smile designs, I always include features for bonding to make it look better, more balanced, harmonised and to last longer. Yeah. A lot of people come see me and they're like, I just want straight bonding because their, their teeth are relatively straight. But that doesn't necessarily mean the bonding is going to necessarily hold out. Yeah. So that's what we're doing with you. That's what we've persuaded you to do. Yeah. Put the teeth into a better position, whiten and then bond so she can smile on her big day. That is the plan. And it's ironic because I've always... I'm adamant I have straight teeth, but okay. they, might, <laughs> they might look straight, but they're not actually straight. And the bottom of them are crowded, yeah. as um, as doctor has said as well. So, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what the potential smile could be. Could you just stay open for me, please? Yeah. Like I say, this is just a rough simulated teaser. This isn't my full smile design planning, but it gives you they do an idea of what we can achieve with Invisalign. So yeah. in detail, these are your lower teeth here before. You can see they're starting to get mildly crowded yeah. and they're chipping at the edges. So what we would want to do is put them into alignment like so, which will obviously look a little bit more uniformed and tidy. You'll get less plaque trapping. Yeah. And then we can put a retainer wire on the back to stop them from moving back to that. Okay? So does a retainer wire stay on it forever? It would do, yes. Um, it's a choice. Obviously, it's optional. But I wouldn't, wouldn't opt out of it because obviously then you have to be excellent at wearing nighttime retainers because teeth will always move. Okay. okay? Yeah. Top teeth in detail. You can see that you've got this spacing here. And here. Yeah. Yeah. If we try and just build that out with composite because the spacing is quite big, you're going to find that the composite will be unsupported and just chip there. Yeah. So you're better off actually putting your teeth closer yeah. together, which yeah. looks tidier. Yeah. And then we can consider doing some composite body. Because we've got tooth modeling, it's a very interesting case. We, we're not just going to do the front four or six teeth. We do need to take it a little bit further back. Yeah. So we can basically, all the teeth that show in your smile will have that uniform colour. So now the next step is for me to get photos of my teeth, like, um, before, right? And then compared to the after, right? Yes, that's true. Hopefully you can get this done. Um, Dr. K said that it's going to require time, which I know. <laughs> Obviously you can't rush your teeth straightening um, out using Invisalign. But we also just can't put the composite bonding on top of it just randomly. So hopefully it can be done this year. Hopefully, but we'll just see how long it takes. Biting down for me, okay? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Perfect. Now, if you just do exactly the same on the other side. And what I said, it's going to go to the other room yep. again. Mm -hmm. And now I'm just going to take some profile shots. Very nice. These are really nice offices. Okay. Really, really nice. First, this is the kind of supermarket I want to be shopping in. Just look at how pretty this place is. So, so cute. I got myself one of these. Actually, really not, but <laughs> here we are. Also, look at the size of this bottle, six liters. Ah. I love this place. Uh-uh, don't close on me. Now let's go and find my car. This place is so nice. I absolutely love this building. They even have a car wash downstairs in the in the garage. How cool was that? So freaking cool. I love it here. I need to go and pay for my ticket. Let me go and pay for this parking and then I'll come back and then decide what to do. Because I'm about 11 minutes away from my fiance. But if I go and see that man, that's how my day is going to be cut in half. Because I'm just going to be like, oh, I'm going to just stay here and chill with you instead of going to do work. So maybe it might pass by my fiance it's just for lunch. Might take him some lunch actually, yeah. Why don't I be a good person? I'm gonna take him some lunch and then I will leave and carry on with the rest of my day. Okay girls, that's the plan. I've got my eggs. I can't wait to devour these now. <laughs> Dr. K's out of the way. Can't wait. Let me go and pay for my parking first though and then I'll be back. Listen, what I will say right now these don't hit anywhere near as much as just the strawberry one. This is strawberry and apple. The apple is giving it sour. It's coming like my mango habanero chicken that I was making. This ain't it. This really ain't it. She says swallowing it whole. <laughs> it's not giving baby food at all. It's giving adult tanfastics. I like those. Mm -mm. 
Mmm, it's too natural. It's missing all the E numbers. So I've stopped over at my booze place for lunch. Oh, wow, hold on. Just as I'm, people are always calling me just as I start vlogging. Hello? Yeah, yeah they said it's been, it's been done. It had to be done by 12.30. Yeah, I'm just waiting for the confirmation. That's why I was kind of rushing. All right. Scary stuff, but 95 kgs is not even that heavy. Mm -hmm. That's rude. That's not inclusive at all. What did I pay? I'm trying to be paid as well. Let me, I'll double check that. What's he gonna drink? What's he drinking? I really don't know the answer to that question apart from cider. A cider, that's what I was thinking. So I'm gonna have to stop by to go and get some cider. Should we cook something? Or you said he's gonna eat before he leaves? I'll confirm with him. Yeah, confirm with him because then I can pick up some chicken and make some chicken wings or something. So that was Dot on the phone. She's calling me about what we're doing tomorrow, which I'm so excited for. You guys will get to see it in the next vlog because today's just a day in my life. We are going skydiving. <laughs> <laughs> this should have happened on her birthday at the start of the year but on her birthday it rained and skydiving is not an extreme sport that you can do when it's raining outside obviously so it was postponed for tomorrow and tomorrow is tomorrow so excited about it though the only thing is that they're very strict on their weight restriction which is at 95 kg max with your clothes on and i feel like that's not even that's not heavy that's really not heavy at all so I think that's a bit unfair because that means that I feel like a lot of people might not be able to do it. 95 kgs, they need to put it a little bit higher, but I guess maybe it's a safety thing. I don't know, I literally don't know. But um, I'm hoping that everybody makes weight tomorrow. Um, we're all going alongside my brother who's also coming around tonight. I didn't even know, like I didn't know until like about an hour ago that he's gonna come stay around mine and I'm so excited for that. So I need to pop by um a supermarket to go and get some cider because he likes some cider he enjoys cider so we can have some drinks tonight before tomorrow just here to say hi to my ball then go and get those drinks and then go back home do some work even take my car to the car wash i have to take my car to the car wash because we're taking my car tomorrow i'm sure of it and that car is dirty it's just so, so dirty, especially the outside of it. The outside is even, is worse than the inside. And that's, that's not me. I'm usually the kind of girl who has a dirty inside of her car, but the outside is just terrible. So I need to go and get it washed and cleaned inside too, but that's not too bad. So guys, I am taking this away. It's my fiance's air fryer. I was, I am and was, I don't know where I stand anymore. Air, I was A. An air fryer, it's not a air fryer. I was an air fryer hater, yes, I was kind of still am, but this is good. <laughs> this, this is art. I want to make some soup tonight, and it just goes so well, and it's just so quick. Lamb soya, just go to the butchers, get some um, lamb, chop it up, clean it, put it in with a bit of lamb seasoning and some chili. Perfect. That's another one of the things that I used to order on Deliveroo way, way, way too often. And it cost too much when you just go and just buy it and make it yourself. So another one of my Deliveroo redos. That's what I'm gonna call them, Deliveroo redos. Um, basically remaking my favorite Deliveroo meals, but at home. And lamb soya is one of them. So stealing this for the night. So it was actually a productive visit. <laughs> got home I have a meeting which started 10 minutes ago no snacks in this house besides me baby okay join we've let people know you're in the meeting hello hi how are you I'm really good thanks how are you both thank you I'm so sorry for running late it's a little bit of traffic just had us on the hooks but we're here um, have a good weekend both of you you too bye bye, bye. Aww. just a few faves Guys, so after my quick meeting, I'm now here at the car wash. I need to get my car wash. My babes needs to be clean. I can't have such a nice, gorgeous car that's not clean, you know? So they're gonna clean it all up for me. I like this uh, car wash because they do it by hand, which is great. I think I prefer that than when you go to the electronic ones and it never really gets the dirt out. 
it never does like it always washes everything but where it needs to be washed so i definitely prefer the hand car washes they're much much better yeah so i'm gonna get my car cleaned and then head home i still need to go to the gym and i still need to go to aldi or Lidl, one of them there's a particular drink that my brother really likes the cider so i'm gonna get that for him because he's coming around later on and i didn't even know i'm so excited like so so excited to have him around can you believe after i packed the air fryer didn't i now go and leave it i left it at my boo's house so there was just no point so no soya for me tonight so bummed out that would have been the perfect Friday meal. Like you know, certain meals just make sense on certain days. See you on a Friday. Nah, it's not gonna happen for me. Unless I put it in the boot, but I don't remember. I was in a rush. You know when you're in a rush when you're leaving. I was in a rush because I had my meeting that I had to make it in time for. The car's clean. I'm feeling good. Feeling so much better. Everything feels organized. Okay, because my house is clean, my house is tidy, but my car was just not. It wasn't in the line. It wasn't in the line. It wasn't in alignment. The car was in alignment, so now it's clean and I'm feeling a lot better for it. Um, now I want to do some content, some light content. I'm saying light as if that's even possible, but that I really just mean I don't want to put on much makeup. <laughs> that's the truth when I say light content. I'm making some reels. I'm really enjoying the real situation right now. I want to make a quick reel before I get to the gym. It's only 3.15, it's not even late at all. It just feels late because it's dark and I need to get over it because it it happens every year. Like it literally happens every single year and every single year I'm like, why is it 3.15, why is it dark outside? Like every year it annoys me, every year it makes me sad, every year it makes me want to stop working at three o'clock, but not in the year of the bag. <laughs> not in the year of the bag, sir. So I'm here quick content um i want to make a reel and that's it and then i think what was i going to say i think i was going to go where am i going i'm thinking about going to the gym thinking about going to the gym but let me see how many steps i've made i've made four thousand steps so i could go and just finish my walk at the gym but i don't know i like the gym i don't like the gym i don't know sometimes sometimes i don't know but i feel like gym right now it might be necessary for me to go there to do my steps because it's so cold outside so really it does make sense to go to the gym but i don't know i just feel like ugh, i don't know ptsd maybe <laughs> ptsd but i do enjoy going to the gym i actually do sometimes enjoy going to the gym because it's like the structure there's machines it's a bit more structured than just kind of walking i feel like sometimes when i'm walking i'm like am i really doing exercise but actually you are Walking is exercise, but um, at the gym it feels like you're actually working out, like you can work out specific muscle groups, you can work out specific whatevers, you know, so sometimes the gym is good. Gym is good for weightlifting. I need to get back to weightlifting, but <laughs> not yet. So yeah, I might go to the gym, but I hate saying I'm going to go to the gym because then when I don't go, oh, I feel so bad. I feel so bad on my own behalf. I'm like, Lydia, again, <laughs> again, another excuse. Oh. And I'm not into self-hate. I'm really not into self-hate, so I don't like to say I'm going to the gym. <laughs> this makeup is so chakra. It's just, honestly, it's just... There's a lot of shots we need to do. Yeah, that's it. Go with it. Change your outfit. How we feel, much better. Looks cute, isn't it? I need leggings that are like black leggings that I can wear out. That are like this, that are not sports ones. These are my 1019 leggings. Um, black owned business so comfortable so stretchy like oh, it's a sin that you can't just wear leggings as normal clothes because that's what i do anyway um i always look like i've just been to the gym or I'm, i look like i'm working out always it's i'm not it's just comfortable <laughs> it's just comfortable but um this is the outfit so we're gonna go shoot some bits i have some gorgeous flowers that came from ify they're so 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 cute and that's what i wanted to use i wanted to use that on my content before they die out <laughs> But yeah, I want to go and enjoy them. And this is fitting. This actually goes well with the flowers, doesn't it? Mm. Cutting them. It's giving summer in the middle of winter. It really is not working out here. We tried. <laughs> we tried to shoot. It's almost been comical. We tried to shoot and I've just gone and spilled water everywhere. And it's just feeling very long. I really thought I had the energy. I really had the energy literally like 10 minutes ago. And then now I'm just like... Friday afternoon? Friday afternoon? Oh. So um, I think we're going to quit. I think in fact we have quit. We've, we've quit. Postponed. postponed. We've postponed the task 
for Monday. And we're gonna take the Friday afternoon off. I don't even have my watch. I took my watch off because I was about to shoot this. I really had intention. My watch was even off. I really had intention of making this work. But it's not working out and I don't wanna force it and then have a be in a bad mood for when my brother comes here. And I haven't even gone to the supermarket yet. That's literally not, oh God, it's a task. Supermarket, oh, and I'm meant to be going to the gym and I even already forgot. By the time I came downstairs, I'm like, oh, I think I'm just looking forward to a nice little day. Doc's like, what about the gym? <laughs> story of your life. I'm like, story of my life. What about the gym? I don't know what the plans of the afternoon is, but I just definitely need to go and get some drinks for my bro. That's a fact before he gets here. So I am now back upstairs <laughs> after the fail of a shoot afternoon. It was meant to be. <laughs> It just wasn't gonna work. You know when you just try something and it's just not working and I didn't wanna invest too much time into it only for it to not work out in the end. So I cut my losses quick, I'm thinking. I hope, working smarter, not harder. Working, I think that's working smarter. <laughs> so instead I'm gonna go to the gym and actually ensure that I go to the gym as opposed to trying to do that task of shooting, it not working out and then me being in a bad mood and then not going to the gym in the end and then being in a bad mood for when my brother gets here, you know, it's a trickling effect. So I had to come to that. Where is my face wash? It's always in her part of the drawer. I have the bottom drawer, she has a top drawer. Only that most of my skincare stuff ends up, I guess, in which drawer. It's not the top one, I'll tell you that for free. Spoiler alert. <laughs> it's the top drawer. But I do lick her skincare too sometimes. Glad to be back in my car. It's clean, it smells so good. And I'm now en route to the gym. <laughs> guys good evening you're probably thinking it's the same evening it absolutely is not it's a few days later on but i wanted to come here and make sure that i end off the vlog properly so basically what happened is i went to the gym i really went in ham like full-on ham and then afterwards i went to the supermarket to get some corona some drinks for my brother who was coming around and i was so excited to see him but tell me why when i got home had my dinner i slumped out completely slumped out on the sofa my brother came around 11 i believe I was out, out like a light. <laughs> I think I just <laughs> kind of opened one eye and like just said, hey, hey, and I, then I fell asleep again on the same sofa, like crazy. I was so, so tired, but that's kind of what the gym does to me when I go to the gym, because I really go in ham. So I'm happy about that. But kind of sad that I didn't even get to spend that much time with my brother when I was so excited to see him, you know? But anyway, I just wanted to come and end the vlog off because I hate when vlogs just kind of end abruptly. So I wanted to come say goodbye, good night to you guys. Um, this uh, hair bonnet is actually Dot's hair bonnet, but I love it. It's really giving auntie though, isn't it? But either way, it's really nice because it's silk lined as well. PJ's Velvet Lux, black owned. And yeah, guys, I'm gonna wish you guys good night from here. And I will see you in Sunday's video. If you've got this far and you haven't liked the video, please do like the video. It just takes a second out of your time. To just press a thumbs up. And also subscribe if you haven't. That really also helps your girl out. 225K we're aiming for for the end of Jan. In that case, guys, I shall see you in my next video. Have a good night, day, evening, wherever you may be. Have a good night, guys. Bye.